In this video, we're going to discuss how to create a function called redirect to locale that redirects users to a page that matches their language preferences. Language preference information is stored in the browser and can be accessed via JavaScript. We start by declaring the function redirect to locale which will contain all our redirection logic. Inside the function, we first retrieve the user's preferred language. The navigator language property returns the browser's language setting. We also use navigator user language as a fallback for older Internet Explorer versions. Next, we define a locale routes object that maps ISO 639 to one language codes to specific routes. For example, N maps to N, which would be the route for English speaking users. You would extend this object with more mappings to support additional languages. We then need to extract just the language code from the provided user language, as it may include a region subtag, like NUS. Splitting the string on the hyphen and taking the first element gives us the language code N. We use this code to check if our locale roots object contains a key that matches the language code. If it's found, we set the Windows location path name to the corresponding root, effectively redirecting the user. If no matching root is found for the detected language code, we default to the English root as a fallback. This ensures that the user always reaches a valid page. Finally, we close our redirect to locale function and call it. This invocation could be placed in a script tag at the end of your HTML document or triggered by specific user actions to perform the redirection as needed.